The Queen Consort delighted Grenadier Guard soldiers on Tuesday when she visited them in Hampshire for the first time since being appointed as the battalion's colonel. Camilla became colonel of the celebrated battalion, whose troops are famous for wearing bearskin hats on ceremonial duties, in December 2022. The senior royal presented medals to 10 soldiers who had been hand-picked for their exceptional service while deployed in Iraq last year, as well as two loyal soldiers being honored for length of service at Lil Barracks in Aldershot. On arrival, she was greeted by Major General James Bowder, Lieutenant Colonel Gerald Johnson, Major James Gatehouse and Warrant Officer Dean Bailey, before being briefed in private by Lieutenant Colonel Johnson in the officer's mess on the battalion's recent deployments and plans for the next year. She then spoke to around 30 officers at a small reception where Lt. Col. Johnson, the commanding officer, presented a champagne toast to celebrate her first visit. She said, Thank you very much, it has been a pleasure to be here. I look forward to seeing a lot more of you in the future. Thanks for subscribing and liking. Camilla then posed for a photo on the steps of the officer's mess, where she joked with 2nd Lt. Archie Denison Smith, 24, who helped recreate a famous photo taken with the late Duke of Edinburgh when he was colonel. He told PA News Agency. She was just asking if I was okay, and then she asked why the two junior officers were on the floor. It was a nod to recreating that picture. We explained why it was. Earlier, after meeting her in the reception, he told PA. She was incredibly charming and it was very humbling. She was very interested and engaged and willing to talk to everyone. We are really, really honored to have her as our new colonel. Later, in the sergeant's mess, she presented a long service and good conduct medal to Sergeant Scott Howcroft and a medal bar, marking an additional 10 years service to Color Sergeant Colin Fitty's existing long service and good conduct medal. She then presented operational service medals to 10 officers and soldiers to honor their efforts in Iraq as their proud families and loved ones watched on. I hope you were interested. Share your opinion in the comments. Subscribe and like.